ਵਿੱਚ Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new, hi, welcome. My name is Kim and I go by Kim or Kiss here on YouTube. Today we're going to do a star seed reading for the month of January 2020 for the Andromedans and the Hydrans. Do you like my beautiful artwork of the light being? And I thought you guys would appreciate this. <laughs> I was just being silly and I just thought this would be a fun little silly childish like intro for the reading and I thought <laughs> I would, it would just cheer you guys up. So, but this is my daughter's. She got it for Christmas and it's really cool. And I used to have one of these as a kid and it's so magical that it literally makes your writing just disappear like that. And do you guys remember these? I had one of these when I was little. It's so cool. And I just thought that'd be a fun idea. So Andromedans, let's get into your reading. Let's pull some cards. But before I do, I wanted to go over some automatic writing and channel messages that I channeled for the Andromedans and the Hydran star seeds. So what I got for you is complete understanding of being, self soul recognition. So I really see you just coming into alignment with your wholeness and recognizing your soul at such a deep level and vast level that it hasn't really been done for you before previously. And so this is a very important time because you're understanding your being your your whole being your essence self and it's very exciting i also heard linear time dissipating so linear time is dissipating you'll have different access to perhaps time travel or accessing different timelines or using time in a way that it just benefits you you can manipulate time in a way that it benefits you and i see also higher states of consciousness for you i see you really tapping in and accessing these and so higher states of awareness and going into higher dimensions accessing higher dimensions that you maybe didn't have access to prior and now because your consciousness has been expanded so much and we are in the year of 2020 clear seeing clear vision clear knowing it's just allowing more to be accessed for you so you're really soaking that knowledge in and you're really accessing higher states of consciousness and higher dimensions than you were able to prior so that's really exciting for you andromedans and so i am going to go ahead and pull some cards for you yours just like flew out all over the floor Oh, wow. Flying everywhere. Okay. I'm using my new tarot deck as well that I got for Christmas from my sister. Oh, wow. Wow. This goes along with the automatic writing that I just channeled for you so much so that it's like scary oh my gosh okay wow so i highly recommend you watch the syrian reading and the Pleiadian if you want to but definitely the syrian because i just feel like the syrians just by you watching that video the reading will help you intake some of their codings and I feel like they hold so much ancient knowledge and because you need this to tap into these higher dimensions just by you watching that video and listening to the light language at the end as well as with the reading you're going to be acquiring a bunch of different light codes that you're going to need to unlock and access these higher states of consciousness these higher dimensions and I feel like it's really going to benefit you. So the Syrian Starseed reading, I highly recommend you Andromedans and Hydrans watch that after this video. It's really going to help you. With you unlocking and accessing, this is an initiation. This is an initiation allowing you into these higher states of consciousness, these higher states of awareness to access this higher frequency information dimensions. And so I see you really praising your light beings, praising your higher consciousness. I see this huge sense of inner peace with acquiring this knowledge and resonating with this knowledge because it's the knowledge that you know so well because it's integrated to your essence being soul. I, I 
feel that you are unlocking the privilege to this information because you are being allowed to receive it, granted permission to receive it from your higher beings because of the good karma that you've been acquiring this past year and prior years. So this is kind of a gift. It's, it's a huge gift that you are unlocking, you are being initiated into. This is, hip, you know, taking communion with your higher self, with your higher light beings, with your guides, your spirit animals. You might have a dove as a spirit animal or fish as a spirit animal. Another thing that I'm seeing with the two fish is Pisces energy, but not even just the Pisces energy that you're tapping into with the emotions. I'm also seeing you fill back up your cup, but I'm also seeing you access the Lemurian awakening consciousness, which yes, we are going into. 2020 is the year of 2020 clear seeing, 2020 knowing, 2020 vision, and Lemurian consciousness awakening, Christ consciousness being unlocked and accessed and brought forth through the world in so many different aspects. And so you're going to hear a lot about Lemuria. You're going to hear a lot about the water worlds being accessed and obtained. And not only with this cup, but we have the eight of cups here too. And if you look at this, this is you like really flying, going deep into the belly of the whale, the Lemurian consciousness, the heart of the ocean, if you will. And I see you also accessing Palladian information too with the white here, but I see you really going deep into this Lemurian consciousness and knowledge and acquiring this and it's being granted, access is being granted to you to receive, to receive, to receive these higher frequencies and dimensions and vibrations and this knowledge of past ancient times in Lemuria, present ancient times in Lemuria and future times in Lemuria that you are accessing you are accessing, you're tapping into these dimensions and it's really, really, it's super exciting because I'm Andromedan too, I just found out, so I'm really excited. I'm really excited for this awakening coming. I think you are all too. <laughs> I think you can feel it. I think you can feel it. Uh, okay, let's get into your reading here. Um, let's get into more of your spread. So this is a romantic partner you can trust. This doesn't have to be just romantic. This can be a spiritual friend or mentor or just someone that's really supporting you. This person you can trust, okay, coming in, in the month of January. You're going to be receiving a lot of excellent advice from the heart from this person and from others as well. And you can trust this information because it's of love. And love is of the highest frequency vibration. And therefore, you can trust it. You can resonate with it. If you resonate with it and it resonates, you can acquire it. And you can allow it to flow within your being and to take the advice from it. You're going to be getting involved in a cultural or creative endeavor. So some sort of creative project, some sort of cultural project. And it's it's really, really exciting. I see you doing something with a group. And that's really, really exciting. Okay. And then, and then I see there's going to be someone very, very wise. And this could be your higher self. This could be a higher god, godhead, goddess light being this could be someone very very ancient and wise perhaps maybe even from the time of lemuria perhaps maybe even from the time of lemuria but it's telling you to get advice from someone professional and objective um this could be for spiritual knowledge this could be for other knowledge but someone who's very knowledgeable in what they do subject on what they teach and you could perhaps be doing some public speaking here coming up um, I, I feel like a lot of people look up to you as well. You have a lot of knowledge that you can give, especially with being granted this permission and these qualities. So I see you maybe involved in some unemotional relationships, but just take in the knowing that the relationships that are meant to be yours will be and the relationships that fall away weren't meant for you. And the universe is just making room for more relationships to come in that will benefit you where you're at along your path with your higher self. So you may be up here, okay, and someone's just not vibing with you and that's okay. These things happen and the universe is just making room for the ones that are vibing at your level or will help you vibe higher, okay? And so I see this coming in, but I see someone huge, some sort of spiritual figure, guru, teacher, coming in, ascended master, Adobe adept is what they like to be called, but I just see someone huge coming in that you'll you'll really be able to look up to and receive information from higher self, perhaps. 
Unity consciousness, and this is a change for you. This is a change of unity consciousness coming in on a very high level. You have access to this. Again, granted permission. Um, it's asking you to do the right thing for the right reasons. Compare traditional versus new approaches to see which works best for you. So I see you experimenting with old traditional ways and values and new traditional unorthodox kind of things and just kind of seeing what works best for you and making your own your own mosaic, if you will, of what works best for you. And a spiritually minded community. So you're growing your spiritually spiritual minded community. I do see you being like some kind of spiritual teacher or advisor, perhaps counselor, or just someone that people look up to for information. People, you're one of the people that people go to when they are in times of need or have issues or just need some advice. They really look up to you and you're providing this unity, unconditional love, unity consciousness for them. So that's really exciting. I also got this card for the Syrians and the Palladians. So maybe you do want to watch the Syrian and the Palladian. Um, we have Six of Winter in the reverse. So this is positive changes that are on their way. 2020 is a huge year. And I've been shuffling the cards before each reading. So it's not that the same cards are coming out because of that. It's These cards are meant for you to hear. There's huge positive changes on their way. This year of 2020 is going to be huge. It's going to be huge for a lot of people. Very self-transformative and exciting. And really helping people shine their light even more and tapping into what they love to do and expressing themselves and doing what lights them up, okay? But positive changes are on their way. A welcome relief from troubled times is coming in. And I, because this was in the reverse, you really don't believe it, but it's happening. This is your card. This is what's happening. Amazing things are coming in this year for you, especially this month of January. And you're going to receive this relief from troubled times. You're going to notice it, and it's really exciting. And you might be traveling or relocating, and that's exciting too. So that's your card there. We have King of Spring. Oh my gosh, a financial windfall is coming in for you. Your leadership skills are needed right now. You're a teacher, you're a leader. Perhaps that person in this card that you look up to is maybe just you and your higher self and you're this teacher and you're this you're this advisor for so many people and they know they can go to you and when they need help or they need understanding with higher dimensional principles and consciousnesses you're there to help them to receive this information at such a level that which they understand it and so they keep coming back to you because you're helping them unlock their awakening codes and their in DNA your leadership skills are definitely near right now. You're going to receive money for what it is that you love to do. And an unexpected supporter of your cause is coming in. Sorry, I just coughed. <laughs> an unexpected supporter of your cause is coming in. Your leadership skills are really needed. You're going to receive abundance for what you do. And it's letting you know an unexpected supporter of your cause is coming in. We have the Emperor card. This is telling you to use logic and structure to increase your success. Really get organized. Write things down. You're a firm but compassionate leader. Again. Again. So a lot of you star seats are leaders. And it's asking you for this year, 2020, to really step up to your leadership roles because your knowledge and your teachings and your information is required right now. It's so crucial and this is a huge time of Lemurian awakening consciousness of Christ consciousness and so your star seed knowledge is really crucial it's really needed right now and it's important that you shine your light out and provide the frequencies provide the information keep doing the mission work and the purpose work that you're doing the service work it's really important then we have wonderful news is on its way again wonderful news is on its way smart choices that bring rewards and success in public recognition. I've been getting this message a lot too. So I see you in the public eye. I see you receiving recognition for all the hard work that you've been putting in. I see like good karma coming back to you. I see a royalty bloodline within your bloodline, within your light being bloodline or your ancestry. I see that being unlocked. So that way you can really step into your leadership role and have the confidence to. I just see a lot of DNA being unlocked. I see a lot of inner light being expressed. And I see a lot of smart choices that bring rewards and good news coming. So that's really wonderful. And then we have Ace of Winter in the reverse. This says, don't be deterred by challenges along the way. It's important to communicate clearly and accurately. I always re recommend Lapis Lazuli, the Rock or Crystal Lapis Lazuli. 
It helps you with your throat chakra. It helps you communicate what it is that you're needing to say in a way that's so effortless and you don't even have to think about it. It just comes across perfectly and people are able to receive that information that much better with that much more potency, okay? So lapis lazuli will be very helpful for you, Andromedans and Hydrans. Don't be deterred by challenges that come up along the way. These challenges are just lessons to be learned and once you overcome them, you're that much stronger. Keep going, stay focused no matter what happens, okay? And amazing new ideas that should be implemented. You have these amazing ideas, this amazing knowledge, and they need to be implemented. If I can't say it anymore, this is the huge message from your reading. Step up to your leadership skills. Step up to your teachings. Step up to your counselings, your advisings, and really share these ideas that you have within your mind. These amazing, brilliant, bright, starseed ideas that you have inside of your mind to share with the world. Share your light. Share your light. Shine your light. Shine your light. Share yourself. Share your expressions. Share, I, share your ideas. Share, share, share. I hope that helped you. We are going to go ahead and get into a light language activation for the Andromedans and Hydrans. I'm hearing to you selenite, so that's what we're going to work with here. We're going to clear out older, low vibrational frequencies, subconscious messages that aren't serving you. We are going to implement higher frequency codes, unlock some, and awaken some DNA that needs and some light codes that need unlocked within your light body. And we're going to go ahead and get going on this. Let's see what I'm channeling in for the Andromedans and Hydrans. Wow. Thank you so much, Andromedans, for allowing me, and Hydrans, for allowing me to channel your beautiful light 
and energy and frequencies and for allowing me to unlock those codes and to transmute lower vibratory codes for the collective. I truly appreciate you. Thank you so much. I love you. I love you so much, beautiful Andromedan and Hydra and Starseed Souls. I hope these messages found you well. If you're interested in booking a personal reading with me or a Starseed Origins reading and really exploring and digging deep into your Starseed lineages and connecting back cosmically, I am offering 20% right now off on all my readings 20% off on all my readings my Etsy shop link is in the description box below if you'd like to browse the different readings that I offer and I'm offering 20% off through till January 11th I love you all so very much I'd be honored to channel and work with you so please keep that in mind I love you all so very much if you have any questions please leave a comment below if you've been resonating with these energies or experiencing them give us a like comment below I would love to hear what you've been experiencing personally as a starseed soul you're beautiful I love you so much and until next time I'll talk to you soon bye